Welcome back to some more Paleo Pines. Yeah, boy. It's not yeah, boy, is it? It's yippee. Hey, look at that. We're back, baby. And we have a brand new update to show off today, which is probably one of the biggest ones they've added in a long time. So we have obviously brand new colors. I think it's five, six, seven brand new colors, which all look amazing. Uh, some content creators, some just community members got to pick some of them. Really excited to hopefully find a couple of them knocking about. We then also have an update to some of the dino mechanic changes. So kind of like Delilah and Lucky can kind of like pick this up well like we clear this and we get items there's a certain handful of creatures which can now pick up like mushrooms and plants without actually having to dismount pick them up get back on which is huge which is so amazing i'm not 100 sure what animals they are or what dinosaurs they are but that is massive and then the other big huge thing is what we're going to cover today our very first event we've got an easter event boys which is amazing so hidden around the map are six chocolate easter eggs we're gonna have to go and find them i'm not sure how big or noticeable they're gonna be but we're gonna be looking in every nook and cranny of the map trying to find them now these eggs are massive because they are like instant taming items so we can if we find a, a i don't know an albino verizino we literally give it a chocolate egg and there we go we have it we don't have to do a pop in so that's huge or you can use it on someone you've already tamed so have we got someone that doesn't have a saddle uh i think all of you are my friend but just say like one of these star aren't my friend i tamed them yesterday i would give them the egg and they would instantly become my friend and i can put a saddle on them and i can ride them um so yeah there's six eggs uh if you don't use them by the time the event ends i think it stays in your inventory so what we're gonna do is probably just go ahead find them all and then save them just in case that they add some new dinos in the future i mean that's spinosaurus i'm sure it'll be here at some point uh before we go anywhere though i need to go and see cupcake because cupcake for those of you that don't know is the skin that i added into the game look at him cupcake come here you beautiful creature we're gonna go see what other creatures people have put into the game there we are that's the skin that we added the pink the blue the orangey yellowy color underneath god damn you're cute Oh, I love it. Cupcake is part of the law of Paleo Pines, which is amazing. All right, so we're going to head out. We're going to have to search every nook and cranny uh, of the map. I'm going to guess there'll be one in the ranch because that just seems like what they'll do. It's going to have to be somewhere you can't build, though, right? I'm just kind of looking in every nook and cranny. Uh, before we do go anywhere else, though, if you do enjoy the Paleo Pine content, if you want to see us do some more, you know, when there's more updates and all that, Go ahead and whack a like. It's completely free to do. Subscribe, ring the bell so you don't miss it anymore. Look at you dancing around, pistachio. Are you dancing around? Yeah, you are dancing. I thought you was a bit broke then. Um, yeah, subscribe, ring the bell, all that good stuff. Follow the social medias. If you want to support the channel that little bit more, you can become a channel member or a patron. It's $1 for a month, and you get an exclusive video every single Friday. Uh, okay, so I'm just kind of having a look. Again, I don't know how big these eggs are going to be, and I really do need to clear this area out. I've been meaning to do it. But I always get, like, distracted by doing other stuff. Uh, so, I'm hoping the eggs are noticeable. I'm hoping they're not, like, too small and, like, hidden. Obviously, I want them hidden. But you know what I mean? Like, I don't want them to be, like, inside a bush. Um, okay. So, I don't not seeing any there. So, there's six to get all together. So, I've got to keep count, which I'm pretty terrible at doing. Uh, how much infantry do we have? We've got tons of space. Okay, uh, would there be any more? Maybe up in the hills over here? Can we get through here? No. Can we get through here? That's what we're looking for, boys. There it is. Chocolate egg. Hell yeah, I knew there would be one. Uh, chocolate egg. A decorative chocolate egg. Safe for dino and archosaur consumption. And dimetrodon. Huh. You could have just said dino. I know Dimetrodon technically isn't a dinosaur. Oh, it's got like... Can we put that down? Oh, we can grab it. <gasps> Yo, look at that. Oh, bro. Easter chocolate eggs. Cadbury's Easter chocolate eggs just slap. That's really cool, man. All right, so we can pop that away. Okay, there's number one. So I'm going to guess... I would guess there'd be one in each like location so there'll be one maybe here one in the town one in the desert one in the forest 
Right, so there's a... No, that's not a mushroom I can pick up. Uh, any colours on you? I don't think we're going to get any new colours today. Just because we started um, halfway through a day. But that's okay, because I think it's going to take to hold it. Can we, like, pick these up? Oh, can we pick these up? Oh, yeah, there we go. Look. I don't think we could have done that before. So we don't have to get off to get uh, clovers. I'm hoping that's the same for, like, dandelions and stuff. Because I used to not pick stuff up because I couldn't be bothered. I was too lazy to just get off. A mount. That's massive. Obviously, we can still pick up that. Okay. I might go to the town first. That might be a good idea. I'm just kind of just having a quick look around. I want to see if there's any uh, dandelions or any of the clovers. That's so cool that we could just pick that stuff up now, though. It's just a small quality of life thing. That just, I don't know. I feel like I connect to my dino a bit more. Oh, here's some. Can we pick these up? <gasps> we can. Does that use stamina, by the way? 250. It doesn't. Bro. That, I mean, I'm happy with all the new skins they had because it just makes such a diverse um, and unique experience when you play the game because, like, there's so many different colors. But that update right there might be the best thing to ever happen to the game. Especially if you're a new player, like, that's just gonna... I don't know, you're not gonna even realise how tough it was to have to find this. You'd used to have to hop off, walk over, grab, pick up, get back on. I don't know, it's just, that's amazing. Alright, let's go into town. Uh, we'll have a look around the valley a little more. Let's just go into town first, because I'm pretty confident there'll be an egg in there. Like I said, this town, desert town, that would be equal three... Forest, valley, and then maybe the main desert. That'd make all the sense. All right, let's see what we can find. I do see some sparkling behind here. There we go, boys. Straight the way, we got it. Hell yeah. Second egg. There we go. Hell yeah. Um. Oh, how do I get out of here? Um, I'm stuck. I'm going to guess there's just the one here. We'll have a quick run around just in case. I can't imagine they'll put two, but you never know. I can always just have a little... <sighs> have a little sit down. Can we y yippee on the bench? We cannot. <laughs> okay, let's try and have a run around the valley. Uh, it is almost evening. I'm not sure what time setting I've got. Uh, it's evening already. I'll tell you what, let's go snooze because we can get new skins tomorrow and see if there's any of the new ones about. You'll be all rested up. Okay. All right, Lila, let's go have a little snooze. I'll be back in a second. Alright, it's a new day. It's a new life. It's what I can't... There's a James Bond song somewhere like that and I can't remember what it is. Alright. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. See if we've got any new colours. Also, kind of looking out for an egg. Can we gather this as well? So pretty much any anything on the ground the Dilophosaurus can pick up. I'm going to guess anything the Dilophosaurus could pick up, the Parasaur could probably pick up, Lucky can do. Ah, oh, this is so, so nice. It's, oh, I just love that so much. Uh, okay, uh, I'm just going to grab all of these as well. Still looking in every little corner just for some eggs. Not seeing any around here. Maybe the treehouse? That seems like a place an egg would be. I don't think there'd be one right out in the open but you know what i should definitely look around just in case also trying to spot if there's any colorful dinos i want to see what these new colors are all about so we have been playing this kind of in a spare time you know every now and then and i do need to show off this because we repaired the windmill and this does stuff i forget what it does uh it makes flour we can make flour using wheat and stuff but, um, yeah, there's, like, a little colourful windmill that you repair. You just bring loads of um, sticks and stones and all that good stuff. Uh, are you a new colour? You're just the green croc. Hello, cute little guys. You seen an egg anywhere? I've looked all over the other end. Uh, like, I've looked all around here. So I'm now going to look around this side. Um, because if not, then I might have missed it. God, I can't wait to see what they do with these. I hope summer happens. Because they're like dotted around all over the place. Uh, hello guys. 
have you seen an egg anywhere? So we've still got that little area to check as well. Just checking bushes. Still got to repair this. This is something that I didn't really know needed repairing. Uh, if you come down here, because I normally don't walk around on foot. This is the mysterious garden. And there's all different sections. And you can, like, build it up and stuff. So that's really cool. But yeah, look at the windmill in the background. I know, man. That looks really sick. Aha! Found it. <laughs> uh, this one is just behind the mysterious garden. For those of you that are going to be following along for it. That don't care for the spoilers. Or maybe just need a little help. Nice. Okay, so... That's number three. I say... I want to do that last. That one's going to be difficult. I say we go to the desert. Uh, none of you have crazy colours, right? I don't think so. That pink one's beautiful. I say we go to the desert. I'm going to guess there's one in the desert and one in the desert town. Uh, it would just make sense. I really want one of these guys as well at some point. So I say we start here in the town. So if we can find a town one, then we'll probably like go out into the open. Just checking there's none around here because this is a big place can i harvest these as well <gasps> oh my god this is just so great i'm gonna keep saying that for some people this is like nothing this is no one cares but i do i care massively i love this okay uh if there was an egg in this town where do we think it would be probably like up top no dudes has anyone seen an egg anywhere around here kind of pretty well hidden but not like too crazy hidden to where you're not going to find them which i like uh you've got a little mission for us hello sir long time no see what are you saying uh do my own eyes deceive me is that axeman who stands before me you aren't a desert mirage no how fantastic archipelago is quite a daunting dander it seems you're quite the intra-traveller. You know what? It's really early to be reading all these words. I don't know what they mean. There's not much uh, audience to be had in these remote parts, but our troop makes do. We just take a short break uh, a present while we wait for audience members to show up. We might be a while. And the fact is, we run on supplies. We can't really leave to gather in here. There could be a very moment that an audience appears, and what will they do without a show? I need at least 20 wood to create a fire at night. The desert gets chilly in the dark. Would you be able to lend us a hand? You wouldn't want us growing cold. Yeah, sure, I can get that done for you at some point, sir. Um, you've got another question mark. Is that another mission? Don't ask, man. Is the farm life still as uh, adequate as ever? It's the best! I hope your dinosaur companions are still making best use of that seed hub I gave you. I've been tinkering about the design recently. I think I may have come up with uh, an addition that could make farming even faster. <gasps> with a bit of training, a small dinosaur could be able to harvest your produce with one of these. Would you try it out? Yes? Bro? Uh, small dinosaurs can use this to store the harvest from nearby crops. Yo! <gasps> Pistachio is going to be able to plant and harvest now? That's huge. Alright, so this little um, town has these little walkways up. Hell yeah, boys! Right, I'm just checking all these bushes. God, I love the music in this town. It just fits so well. Delilah, park your beauty there. You're doing a great job so far, by the way. Carrying us around here. God damn, I love that creature. All right, any eggs? Uh, no, no, coconuts. We'll take them, though. Thank you. We'll take this. I've uh, got it. It was behind this one. Um, Cool. So whatever that one is, I forget. There's that one. Hell yeah, boys. Okay, let's have a little run around the desert. So that's number four. So there's two more. So yeah, it's, there's got to be the desert and the forest, right? There has to be. Uh, okay, I'm going to... Oh, did we ever finish? Oh, I did finish this windmill as well. See, I've been busy off cam. Uh, there's that windmill. I think this one makes dyes. Uh, let's see. Yeah, black dye factory. There's all the different colours here. Red dye. And I think you can use that for when you make clothing. Some of the longer lines of that. I don't know. I've not played around with it. I just fixed it because it looks really cool. Uh, we may have found a couple new colours. This dude looks crazy in blue. I'm not sure if that is a new colour or I've just not seen that one. Look at this Dilophosaurus though. 
This brown and black one? I've definitely not seen that. I'm just going to see if we can... Uh, I, I want this. That's what I want. I just want to see if I can get a look at what colour he is. You over there. Hello. Are you going to come over this way? Hell yeah, boys. Alright, it's been a while since I've done this. And that looked good. Yo, okay, so let's put them to sleep and we should be able to get a book on them. So we're going to soothe you. Damn. So I'd, I'd love the vibrant ones, obviously, like the pinks and that. Oh, no. Did I sort of run into him? God damn it. They're all going crazy. Hang on. I just want to see what color it was. <laughs> Stupid love stories all went crazy. Okay, let's try this again. Yeah, I love the vibrant colors, but sometimes like these colors black browns like the dull colors i oh, know it's a nice change of pace all right let's try this again hopefully the other dudes don't go zoom in knock into him all right and then we should be able to grab the book out it's a willow uncommon ah i don't know if that's like i don't know if that was from this update or the last update but that's really cool Hell yeah, boys. Well, as we're here, we've got to go and check on the Protoceratops because these dudes are just the cutest. Do you have any cool colors? God damn, they're cute. Um, I think I've seen the yellowy one before, maybe. I do like the pink color one. Obviously, very common, though. God damn, them things are cute. I will grab you guys one day. Was that an egg in there I saw? Oh, no, but it's an artifact. Wait, did that say I could do that on the back of you? No, okay, I can just click on you. How have I not grabbed that yet? I've been up here. I must have just not seen that in there. Oh, you know what I completely forgot? There's like caves and stuff down here. Um, I'm wondering... Like, that'd be a good place to hide it, right? I'm wondering if there's one down here. This is like right deep down? No? I think there's another cave or another walkway like this that leads to the uh, the weird crystals. Maybe our good friend, the Cactus Man, will give us um, like a hint on where we would find one. Hello, Mr. Cactus Man. What, what wonderful insight have you got for us today? Something wonderful is about to happen. Oh. You got one behind you or anything? No. Aha! Uh -huh, but we have one here! Hell yeah, boys. Nice. Okay. Which means that's five out of six. And there's one more. And it just has to be in the forest, right? It just has to be. Uh, what time of day is it now? All right. I think we could go home. Because uh, I've got some crops to harvest. We can chuck down that little bucket thing. The little bowl for pistachio. I mean, to be fair, I'd much rather him just collect things. Because planting's easy. I can do that. Okay, let's uh, let's do that. And then hopefully we get a new, like, recycle through the colours again. Cycle, not recycle. We cycle through the colours. And then we'll head into the, the big old forest. All right, so... Oh, it's big. Oh, yeah, it shows you what we can harvest. Okay. Um... Just there would be great, actually. Okay, so there's that. So, I need you, Pistachio, to maybe follow me a minute. Uh, come here. So, follow me. I think if we get him close to it, we then be like, hey, do this job. Come in, Pistachio. Good shit. Um, yeah, there we go. Help with harvesting. Nice. Pistachio has a new work hub. Hey! Good job, Pistachio. Oh, I love this little guy. He's so freaking cute. Um, I think this is all I have to harvest today. Normally, I'd get the Verzino to do this, but... I can just grab all these right now. I don't need to water any of them. Do we need to do any weeding? Uh, just an artifact to show. Oh, yeah, boys. All right. Um, Delilah, you can go home. I did want to try another dinosaur picking stuff up. Let's just go and chuck some of this away. 
I'll sell all of this in a bit. So, obviously, Lucky can do the same as the Dilophosaurus is. I wonder if... Cupcake... Cupcake, do you reckon you could pick stuff up? Let's just, like, run into the desert or run somewhere. Let's see if you can pick anything up. Like, maybe it's all dinos now can just pick the little easy stuff up. Come here, you beautiful little girl. Aha, I've got something just here. Okay. So, let right, right, Lucky, you can pick this up, right? Yes, you can. Cupcake, can you pick it up? Or is it going to be ones with just, like, hands? Okay, yeah, it's just certain ones. All right. So I'm going to guess it's ones that can maybe do the digging. Uh, maybe, like, a Baryonyx could probably do it and stuff. You know what? As we're here... Cupcake, can you break this rock for me? Because I've not broke this, and there is a Dreamstone behind that. And I will definitely need that bad boy. Nice. Large Dreamstone, boys. Hell yeah. All right, uh, let's get home. We'll have a little nap. Um, I'll do all the general stuff we do in the mornings, uh, clean up all the pens, feed them, harvest any stuff, and then we'll head out to the forest and see if we can find the last number six egg. <gasps> Yo, look at that. We found one. Okay. Well, I need the purple Staracosaurus for sure. Uh, we'll grab that at the end of the episode. That could be a little bonus for today. Yo, he's beautiful. You know me. I love my pinks. I love my purples. Okay, that's Fire Flame. It's also um, Triassic Picnic Day. Uh, we've obviously covered that before. We've just got to give him as many foods as possible. Ooh. Yo, we've got a purple um, galley as well. And a yellow one. Purple circus also there. Uh, yeah, so it's the picnic day, which means I've just got to go and give them as many crops as possible. And then there's a greater chance of finding a rare creature next day. But we don't have to worry about that. We're just going to quickly go find this egg. Uh, we can pick mushrooms up as well. Hell yeah, boys. Now what we need is a dino that can do the bushes. I don't know if there is or not. Okay, this is going to be the hardest egg to find. God damn, I thought that was it then. Because there's so many bushes... It's such a big place. So easy to get lost around here. Oh, man. Freaking purple Staracosaurus. That's so cool. Uh, we've got any cool ones down here. It's kind of the standards. I keep thinking like, oh, I can just look at the dinos and move on. But I've got to find this egg. Um, th none of them have really been in like iconic locations. You know what I mean? Like they're just randomly in and around a bush i just found it boys okay um sort of difficult to find it's just here because there's no way i'm going to explain it because the whole of this place looks the same um north of the lake area i guess maybe uh that's where the megalosaurus is that's where the barry is just here on the stump and that should be all of them all six eggs i'm 97 percent sure that it's six eggs. Hell yeah, boys. Okay. I'm just gonna have a quick ganders just around here. Just in case we've got any of the rare colour creatures. But if not, we're gonna head back. We're gonna grab that purple Staracosaurus real quick. Uh, there's another windmill we've got to repair up there. A few stegos. What if we have a really rare Rex? Rosinos. Looking fabulous. Uh, you guys, I forget what you're called. Looking awesome. And then down here should be our Rex. Ooh. It's like a brownie orange color. That's pretty cool. Hey, Mr. Rex. How you doing? All right. Let's go home. Let's go and get a crunchy poppin. Let's go and get this purple freaking Staracosaurus, boys. All right. We've got everything ready. I think I did say crunchy uh, popping. Uh, it was juicy, by the way. Completely forgot. Um, I had one juicy one left, and I've got a few bits. But you know what? It wouldn't have mattered because we do have the chocolate egg. We could use that just to demonstrate, but I don't know if I want to save it. Uh, we'll see how I feel. Okay. Boom. God, you look cool in purple, man. All right. Let's see what we're doing here. So I'm wondering if we just give it an egg at any point. I wonder if it would be instantly tamed i don't know i kind of want to try but i don't want to waste an egg you know what i mean 
you know what? Let's just do it normal. We'll save the eggs for another day. Maybe someone can let me know. If I fed it a chocolate egg right now, would I befriend it? Would it become a friend or do I have to get it on the, the dark green? All right, so we've got a bunch of little juicy treats for it. Yo. I wonder if this is a skin that got added or it's always been in the game and it's just really rare. All right, maybe another, another one of these. That's so cool. I love purple. Purple, pinks, such great colors. And that's pretty perfect. Uh, all right, so we're going to befriend. So actually, wait, wait, wait. Can we go back? Uh, if I was to feed you. Okay, yes, yeah, so I can't feed you with that. So I would have to literally click befriend and give you a chocolate egg. But that's okay, because we've got a juicy pop in here. And my calculations are correct. <laughs> if I read properly, then this works. Hey! Oh, we're going to need a name for you. A purpley name. Grape jelly, maybe? Oh, man. That's cool. Um, I do like grape jelly. There we go. Oh, you're adorable. Uh, can we get the book out? What color are you? Uh, it doesn't tell us. Oh, a violet haze. Uncommon. Did that get added recently? I don't remember seeing Violent Haze. And I think all the added ones are rares? Maybe? <laughs> Question mark? I don't know. Oh, you're really cool. All right. Come and join our Styracus. Guys, can we get inside the pen, please? Come on. No. What, what are you? What? God, these dudes are so silly. I swear. All right. Um, right. Let's get you inside then. That's just going to add a whole lot of colour. Okay, let's get you. And this is your home. There you go. Uh, I think we need a dreamstone in here, right? Yeah, we're going to need one. God, look at them all. I honestly love my Stericosauruses. Um, So what were all our names in here? Uh, how do we do this? There we go. Grape, Jelly, Mint, Rocky, Cupcake and Ruby. That's pretty cool. Uh, you know what? It's lucky because we did get a large dreamstone today. Uh, so let's go and pop that in. Uh, clear up a bit of this rubbish just there. Oh, man. I love this game. Oh, what's this? Uh, Red Valley Lanterns. Hell yeah, boys. I must have ordered them and completely forgot. Uh, oh, yeah, they look nice. Okay, uh, large dreamstone. We just need the one, but we've got two. That's always nice to have a spare. And we can pop that one in this corner. I've kind of just put all my dreamstones in um, the corners of this. So we can go... Hmm. You can't go right in the corner. Interesting. Okay. That works, though. All right. So if we go into this now, everyone should be happy. Just need to clean the pen. Hell yeah, boys. Nice. Well, there we are then. So, we got... Oh, look at them all. They're like, hey, I'm the new one here. Can I play? Can I be friends? And then I, like, yep. Of course you can. Because we're nice creatures. All right, let me just clean this poo out of the way so you can all talk to Look, them two are friends now. Ah, uh, hello, Grape Jelly. I love that purple. I'm going to keep collecting different colors of these. They're definitely my favorite. Oh. They boop snoots. How can you not love this game? I think they did win Game of the Year for some game awards as well, which is so cool. Well done, Pele Pines. <laughs> All right, we're going to wrap it up. We're going to call it a day there then. So we showed off kind of the new mechanics uh, that you can pick up flowers and herbs off the ground and mushrooms, which is amazing. Uh, we found all the Easter eggs. Going to save them for when they add... A new creature, for sure. Or if I find something really rare and I don't have the poppins for. Should definitely keep them for safety. And uh, we saw maybe a new colour. I'm not sure. But yeah, there's new colours added. If you're following their social medias, that they've been showing them off and stuff. Uh, the community members on content creators have been adding them in. But um, yeah, there we are then. So we will be back on Pele Pines again sometime in the future. So yeah, make sure you're whacking and liking, you're subscribing and following the social medias. And, you know, just keeping with the channel so you don't miss it. But um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, thank you very much. I will catch you all in a bit. Say bye, Delilah.
God damn your cute. All right, see you later.